Hi guys, hi YouTubers, hi followers. Hello everyone and welcome. We will wait one or two more minutes and then we will start. Thank you. So welcome to today's webinar, Introducing Bitdefender Gravity Zone XDR. My name is Ana Diakon, I am a Marketing Program Manager at Bitdefender and I will be your host today. It's my pleasure to welcome our speakers, Cristina Sherban, Principal Product Marketing Manager and Daniel Daraban, Group Product Manager. Before we start, a few housekeeping rules. Please note that you are muted as we are recording this webinar. We will provide access to the recording within the next couple of days after the session. Throughout the presentation, we encourage you to submit your questions in the questions box because we are going to host the Q&A session at the end of the presentation. And now over to you, Christina. Thank you very much, Anna. Hello, everyone, and welcome to our session today. My name is Christina Sherban, Product Marketing Manager, and together with Daniel Daroban, Group Product Manager, we are really excited to take you through the highlights of Bitdefender Gravity Zone XDR solution. We will discuss today about some of the challenges customers are facing and how the Bitdefender XDR solution is able to address them. We will go through the value proposition and main differentiators in the market, as well as the launch plan, before I hand it over to Daniel to take you through the technical deep dive. At the end, as Anna mentioned, we will host the Q&A session. Let's get started. There are a lot of challenges that continue to make the job of security professionals difficult. First, the attack surface is expanding. As we move to the third platform of computing, the perimeter has all but disappeared. Mobile, cloud, and social trends continue to expand organizations' networks outside of their traditional span of control, creating a vast attack surface. Second, attackers are becoming more sophisticated and targeted. They are well-resourced, patient, and if they have their eyes on an organization, they will find a way in. And third, the existing strategies and controls we as an industry have invested in over the past decades are failing us at detecting and responding to these inevitable attacks. We believe that security teams need comprehensive visibility across their environment, from endpoint to the cloud, and that they need to increase the efficiency and strategy of their security teams and operations and that the tools and processes we work with need to evolve to meet today's threats. Nowadays, many organizations are starting to understand that they need greater visibility. So they're collecting as much data as possible. Frequently adding multiple point security solutions. This is to make sure they have all their bases covered, basically, as few blind spots as possible. 
This means organizations are being floated with information from individual data sources with absolutely no correlation across them. Every new point solution that is introduced requires added expertise within the security team. And even when that expertise exists, those individuals are probably choking on data, unable to separate important alerts from false alarms and noise. And they don't have the ability to recognize the connecting data between each function. In fact, adding additional point solutions may in some cases have an inverse effect on the effectiveness of security teams. Each new point product adds an additional set of variables that should be correlated with other data, making correlation orders of magnitude more difficult with each new data set. The longer an attack goes undetected, the greater the risk to the business. Therefore, rapid response and remediation for what is most important is critical. Unlike a quick smash and grab attack on a web server or external app, when an attacker has access to a network, they become increasingly smarter and harder to stop. They learn about the architecture and critical systems. They take over more user accounts. They increase their access privileges. They discover where more and more of the valuable information lives. They learn about the company's defenses and how to circumvent them. They may even use the infrastructure to launch attacks on the targets, and they become increasingly tougher to eradicate. When less than 20% of breaches are detected by internal means, meaning attackers often have access to for weeks or months, risk to the organization is significant and underestimated. Clearly, our ability to detect, respond, remediate, and connect security incidents to business risk is paramount. To summarize the previous points, we'll take a look at the overall market problem. The story is not a new one. Organizations need to protect an ever-increasing attack surface with more devices, identities, and data across a growing and heterogeneous infrastructure that is targeted by innovative attack techniques. Over time, this has led to security teams adding additional technology at the problem. This has just exacerbated the situation and tipped the scales in the favor of the attackers. Defenders are now left with overwhelmed security teams, a lack of visibility, silo data, desperate security technologies with too many screens and too many alerts. After decades, of failing CM deployment, it is time to look at, the, at solving the problem differently. We must stop pulling disparate data sources into a data lake and asking security teams to figure out what is useful to create detection rules and to integrate a response to additional security tools. We must provide a way for organizations to rapidly identify threats and the root cause of incidents so they can confidently take action before business damage is done. In a hyper-connected world where cyber attackers seek to do harm 24 seven and organizations face unpredictable risk, becoming resilient is the goal. This is where XDR comes in. Bitdefender Gravity Zone XDR enables security teams to analyze and detect intrusions from across their infrastructure, applications, and workloads with more accurate detection and rapid response. Gravity Zone XDR combines advanced threat protection with out of the box analytics and rich security context for correlation of disparate alerts, 
quick triage of incident and attack containment through automated and guided response. It can detect known and unknown attacks with built-in and extensible analytics and remediate threats before they cause business damage. Gravity Zone exposes the full scope of the attack by providing unparalleled visibility, connecting incidents over time, and delivering deeper context through automated evidence collection and root cause analysis across endpoint, cloud, identity, network, and productivity application data. Gravity Zone XDR is a cloud delivery product for organizations that want to run the technology in house. For organizations looking for a managed service, Bitdefender MDR leveraging Gravity Zone XDR keeps organizations safe with 24 7 security monitoring, advanced attack prevention, detection, and remediation, plus targeted and risk based threat hunting by a certified team of security experts. We focus our communication around four main pillars and a supporting statement. The first pillar talks about extended visibility. The solution observes attacks and advanced threats while consolidating monitoring across the business, from physical devices to virtual assets, connected devices and cloud platforms and workloads. The second pillar focuses on Bitdefender's proven detection capabilities. It comes with out-of-the-box detection of advanced threats protecting the organization from day one while enabling customized detection for your unique use cases to provide incident and alert triage, reducing investigation efforts, and increasing security operations efficiency. The third pillar talks about the rich context around incidents. It reduces the investigation and response time by automatically providing the necessary context to gain visibility and understanding of the root cause at the organization level. It provides access to instant overview and details in a form easy to consume by less experienced security analysts. And the fourth pillar, focuses on the automated guided response recommendation. The solution enables rapid end-to-end -end response and breach containment by combining fully automated and guided response recommendations across the organization. The supporting statement highlights that Gravity Zone XDR is easy to use and delivers value out of the box. There's no need for custom integrations detection, rule creation, or third-party security tools. In terms of differentiators, we believe our solution has better observability. Bitdefender XDR is a comprehensive single vendor solution for endpoint, network, identities, and cloud workloads. Our easy to deploy and manage sensors enable organizations to bring in data from across the environment, not just from managed endpoints. Added context and correlation automatically triage incidents and bring the most important threats to the top. We then focus on our best-in-class detection as a key differentiator because XDR comes with industry-leading prevention and detection methods applied to a broad set of data sources. We have developed multi-tier correlation and detection algorithms delivered both locally to the sensor and at the cloud platform level. We are not reliant on other security vendors' technologies for detection. Additionally, we enable security teams to create their own detection rules. The third key differentiator is around automated threat identification, triage, prioritization, and response. That is designed for teams with varying skill sets. With XDR, customers can automatically build the root cause analysis and contextualize it with automated and guided 
investigations of incidents. At one screen with all the data needed for confidently take action. The fourth key differentiator is around our single click rapid non endpoint response that is executed directly from within the XDR platform. Unlike open XDR vendors, we don't ask security teams to integrate workflows or rely on a separate security orchestration, automation, and response software technology. We provide out-of-the-box response actions across endpoints, identity, email, cloud application, and network controls to rapidly respond to threats from one integrated console. Before we move forward to the technical deep dive, let's briefly discuss the XDR launch plan. The XDR solution has been made available since March 31st. The external announcement is scheduled for April 14th, when, in addition to the press release, we are also organizing an external webinar where Amy Blackshow, VP of Product and Technical Marketing at Bitdefender, together with Daniel, will discuss the main capabilities and components of the XDR solution. It is a great opportunity for your teams to join the session and also invite customers and prospects so they can have access to the first-hand information about the new solution Bitdefender is bringing to the market. We will also publish dedicated content such as product and solution pages, a data sheet with the technical details, blog articles, as well as sales enablement collateral. These being said, I will now hand it over to Daniel for the technical deep dive. Thank you, Christina. So uh, if we move on to the next slide, let me start by explaining our philosophy here at Bitdefender when it comes to building new products. When we want to build a great product, we always start from the problems the customers are facing and build it based on their continuous feedback. So before I even start explaining what Bitdefender Gravity is on XDR is, I want to clarify some of the main reasons behind the existence of the product. Now, as you know, XDR is a highly misused term within the cybersecurity space. But if there is something that everyone agrees to is that there is no XDR without the ability to correlate data from multiple sources across the entire organization. And those sources need to cover both places where you can deploy an agent and places where you can't deploy an agent. Now, Christina mentioned decades of failed SIM deployments, recognized by the industry, by clients, even by SIM vendors. And then I'm looking at our direct competitors and see them throwing data into a data lake and only giving the ability to search that data, claiming search and detection rules as XDR. These have been key use cases for SIM for the last 10 years. That is not XDR. Now, Going back to XDR, XDR needs to correlate data from multiple sources to reduce the time it takes the security analyst to understand what is happening. There is no value if you just generate incidents that have no context. Therefore, when an analyst is looking into an XDR incident, the security analytics layer must answer all of the immediate questions the analyst would have. And only by doing this, you can truly solve the problem of reducing the attacker dwell time. With that in mind, I'll try and summarize our view on XDR. At a fundamental level, XDR for us here at Bitdefender is a product manifestation of the security analytics concepts that must solve big cybersecurity industry problems with a strong emphasis on avoiding legendary issues related to non-deterministic threat detection models, for example, alert fatigue or incident fidelity. And with that, let's explore the different capabilities of Bitdefender XDR, starting with the collection of data from uh, different sources. Christian, can you switch to the next one? Thank you. So email still represents one of the largest attack vectors within an organization. So 
this should not come as a surprise that one of the most asked data sources is Office 365 by far. And this was validated in our XDR early access program as well. An important mention is that when we say Office 365, we are not only covering email, but we cover places where other products are completely blind, like OneDrive, SharePoint, and MS Teams. The other big topic in each customer or prospect or analyst call was identity. So we started surveying about the different identity mechanisms that are used today. And the large majority of the companies we spoke with are using Active Directory in either one or both its flavors, on-premises or Azure AD. Now, in terms of cloud, we will cover AWS. And on the network side, we will use our well-known network sensor. I mentioned in the beginning of my section that there is no XDR without correlating data in to incidents. And you are 100% correct to think that we are using each data source when we generate extended incidents, correlating data from endpoint, network, email, cloud, cloud productivity suites, and identity, covering two major use cases, identity and lateral movement within an organization. Now that we collected the data, we need to let the customer visualize it. And this is what we will talk about in the next slide. Our early access program allowed us to get feedback directly from customers and to understand their day-to-day -day struggles. Now, funny enough, here is something that might sound exaggerated, but we actually listened to our customers and prospects, and we are delivering an incident advisor for extended incidents, containing a summary of the incident, the root cause, an organization impact, and immediate highlights to help anyone understand why the incident was triggered, what happened, and how to respond to it. Now, working together with our customers and prospects, we all agree that the best place to provide the immediate response is from within this new section. The response contains recommendations, endpoint actions, and non-endpoint, Office 365 Active Directory actions, all of which are going to be executed with a single click. And of course, Thinking of the security analyst that needs to know what has been done so far on the incident, we are providing a complete list of all executed actions, regardless if they were taken automatically by Gravity Zone or if they were taken manually by the analyst itself. Now, the incident advisor is the new default landing page when opening an extended incident, allowing the security team to easily identify incidents that need immediate attention. Now, if the analyst needs to perform a deep dive into various events within the extended incident, he or she can open the improved incident graph. In the new graph, what we've done, we've separated the initial access point, the exit points, and the organization itself. All of the data sources that I mentioned in the previous slide can easily be identified in the graphical representation, as well as any alert on the transition between two nodes. Now, as we move on to the next slide and to a more advanced part of a day-to-day -day operation for the security teams, whenever you need to dig deeper into data, you need enhanced investigation capabilities. Can you switch to, yeah, thank you. So we have dra dramatically improved the historic search capabilities from filtering to the way we display the data. Of course, as XDR goes beyond the endpoint, you will also be able to run queries across multiple data sources. If you need more data, you can always choose to gather a forensic investigation package across any operating system, Windows, Linux, and Mac. Now, we also delivered a full remote shell, which has been praised on several occasions uh, by the customers that are using it as part of early access. And this Full remote shell has proven time over time to be the Swiss army knife of investigation and response. Now, I always believe that the picture is worth a thousand words. So switching to the next slide will allow us to better understand how, how all of these tie together within the Defender Gravity on XDR. There are several capabilities that will be covered by XDR from collecting data and generating detections across multiple sources to centrally correlating them into extended incidents, 
increasing the ability to visualize, investigate, and respond at the organization level. In every discussion I had, I received the following question. What will be included by default within the product and what are add-ons? So if we take a look at this slide, we can easily spot what is non-endpoint telemetry and non-endpoint response. All of the endpoint capabilities will be included by default in Gravity Zone Enterprise, formerly known as Ultra. Next, I want to show a typical XDR scenario where the attack spreads beyond the endpoint and the attackers are compromising Office 365 and Active Directory accounts. Then they are moving laterally within the organization to find the sensitive data they were after in the first place. And finally, deploying ransomware to clean their tracks. Let's do an exercise and imagine that we have the best highly skilled analyst in the world working for our customer. With the current set of products he has installed in his environment, it would take the analyst, let's say, approximately one hour to investigate what happened on each endpoint. Another two hours to correlate the events across those endpoints. Then another couple of hours to figure out which other data sources were involved, and then let's say another hour for investigating each data source. By being the best in the world, he quickly isolated the endpoints he investigated, but his colleague who was in charge of the Office 365 infrastructure was not in the office that day. So he couldn't do anything about those compromised Office 365 accounts. So while our highly skilled security analyst is investigating, the attack can continue to spread in other parts of the organization. Putting all those hours together, the dream security analyst would need roughly 14 hours of continuous work to grasp the entire picture of the attack. Now, take a second and think of the following. How many of your customers have this highly skilled analyst in their team? While you come to the same conclusion as we did, just imagine how this highly skilled security analyst time would be used for proactive work and not reactive work. If there was a product that out of the box provided automated correlation of data from multiple sources, a root cause for the incident and a single click executed response. In short, this is exactly what Gravity Zone XDR delivers a single product that is able to provide visibility on attacks at the organization level, highlighting what happened, how it started, why it happened, how it spread, and how to immediately respond to it. Now, switching to the next incident, we can take a quick look at the incident advisor for this particular scenario and think how useful it is to have all that information correlated, structured, and most importantly, human readable. Think of the benefits that this gives to the security analyst who is now able to triage incidents in a matter of minutes and respond directly on the organization level without relying on others that might be on vacation or maybe they are just slow to respond. Of course, if you need to investigate further, in the next slide, we can see the graph. And in that particular graphical representation, we highlight each step in the kill chain for you so that you know which was the initial access and where it exited your organization. With Bitdefender Gravity Zone XDR, you are always aware how the attack spread across different entities within your organization. By providing all these capabilities out of the box, we surpass any competitor and deliver a true solution for a real customer problem and not just another fancy acronym misused by the industry. Thank you. Thank you very much, Daniel. <laughs> that was very insightful. Uh, we now um, can take a look at some of the questions uh, from our partners. Sure, just give me one second. Uh... Um, I see a... Uh, a question here. Um, if it's not bringed out during the presentation, when would the 
XDR be available for MSP program monthly licensing? Uh, I can take uh, this uh, question. We are currently working um, to uh, develop an MSP version, and we are um, we plan to target the end of Q2 to, to deliver this. Of course, um, if things change, we will let you know. Um, I have a, I see another question. Um, any Google Workspace integration like Office 365? Uh, yes, that is currently um, part of our 12-month uh, uh, rolling roadmap, and uh, we plan to deliver uh, a Google in, uh, integration just like Office 365. Um, another, another question, question that I see here, yeah. uh, sorry, is regarding uh, the presentation. Uh, will it be available in the PAN portal? Yes, for sure. The uh, webinar is recorded and it will be available for uh, later uh, in the PAN portal. Okay. Um, I see another question. Is Gravity Zone XDR replacing any other pro uh, products, services that uh, are currently available in Gravity Zone? Uh, no, it's not replacing any other products. It's basically uh, another layer on, uh, on top of uh, our existing uh, portfolio. Um, then I see another question. Uh, what network devices vendors are supported to gather network information? Uh, we actually use our own network sensors. Uh, so those network sensors, they come as virtual appliances. They can be um, deployed within um, the customer infrastructure and um, they sit on tap so they are not in line there's no performance uh, uh, degradation for the network uh, we take the, the data coming from the network and we send it to uh, gravity zone where we use that data to build those extended incidents just like I showed um, I see um, a question. If a customer has EDR currently from Bitdefender, how would he upgrade via license so only? So um, what, uh, what I was trying to, to mention in the um, slide uh, with the entire architecture is uh, that the majority of the capabilities are going to be uh, included in um, Bitdefender uh, Gravity Zone um, enterprise or formerly known as Ultra, our EDR. Um, the only things that are add-ons are the non-endpoint um, telemetry data and non-endpoint response. So Office 365 is an add-on, um, the identity part is an add-on, network is an add-on, and um, the AWS integration are um, is also an add-on. Um, there are a lot of questions that are, uh, I would say, duplicates. Uh, I see uh, a question. Uh, what is the main difference between MDR and XDR? So think of it like this. Uh, Christina, do you want to, to take this one or should I? Please take it. I, OK. Um, XDR is the product and MDR is the service on top of the product on a very, very high level. So um, while well, XDR is uh, providing all of these parts within the product, so the automated correlation, everything uh, between it, MDR is the service that uses XDR to uh, deliver uh, security services for uh, you and your customers. Uh, I'm trying to, to find questions that are not uh, repeating. So just give me one second.
Um, I see um, a, a question. How does XDR collect info from non-endpoint sources? Um, we've uh, built uh, different sensors. So uh, for Office 365, we have a uh, sensor. Uh, basically, it's an integration that you um, set up within the Gravity Zone console. For Active Directory, it's a um, module as part of uh, the agent. So basically, you need to deploy the agent on the domain controllers. And for AWS, uh, uh, we have an integration where we are uh, fetching data directly from um, from the AWS console and the network sensor I mentioned, it's a virtual appliance. Um, and I think that's kind of it. And as I mentioned, there are a lot of uh, questions that are uh, similar. Uh, thanks, Daniel and Christina. Yes, I think we can have a look at the, all the questions after this uh, webinar and see if there are additional ones uh, we can um, reply to offline as well via email. And uh, again, thanks um, for the presentation today. Also thanking our partners for joining. Uh, we will follow up in the upcoming days, as said, with the on-demand webinar. Um, and the presentation and wish you all a great rest of the day. Thank you. Bye bye. Thank you. Bye bye. If you need to contact us for any information, you can reach us on the website link that's going to be in the description. You can also contact us on our live chat service. You can contact us on the YouTube comments. We'd be more than happy to assist you. You can reach us at acs.cyberservices.com and the contact numbers are plus 44 for international dial and that would be 1704. 893447. You can also reach me on my mobile at 07494 If you need to contact us on any further information about that webinars or demos, please let us know and I am one of the team will be very happy to assist you. Thank you. But please note that when you um, are coming to us with regard to an educational request, please also send in some form of identification or if you are a member of staff, say the IT administrator, Please send in a letter from the head teacher with a manual signature, manual signature, so that we can apply an educational discount. But please be aware that you may have to buy so many licenses in order to get 